Hi friends and subscribers, this is Mehmet Sheikh and from past few videos, I am working on developing a blog application using PHP and MySQL server. In my last video, I completed the functionality of displaying these posts on our dashboard and in this video, I will be discussing how to view a single post, Okay, uh, that is how to view the complete details of a single post in some other page. Okay, so in my la at the end of my last video, I, um, I attached the link of each of these posts to these uh, buttons or to these links okay so whenever I place the cursor on any of these links you will see on the left bottom side that which is here uh, you will see the link which is 127.0.0.1 slash php block slash view dot php question mark id equals to one okay so whenever I'll be clicking on this view by link another page with a name called as view.php will get called where i will see the details of this post whose id is one okay so now we need to create that uh, page view.php okay so for that let's go to our editor and then right click here then click on new file and then save it as view.php okay now uh, let's print something like h1 view post okay now save it okay now let's refresh and click on this view okay now it's displaying view post okay so now we need to get access to this id equals to one okay so we need to get the get access to this id uh, information so that i can fetch the information of the of the post whose id is one okay so that i can get the details like a title description category and image of the post from the table whose id is one okay so let's do that okay so for first okay let's delete it okay so i'll just go to my okay okay let's just include our header and footer include okay, inc slash header dot php just copy right here and then footer dot php okay and inside need to use a div with a class container okay save it Let's refresh okay now our header is displaying and we need to get the id okay so we need to uh, get the access to this id so for getting the id from the url we need to use id equals to dollar underscore get okay and then id okay now let's echo this save it okay, now let's refresh okay now you can see the id of that post one is displaying here okay now let's go back and if i click on view link of second post then i should get the id of two which is the id of that post okay so now based on this id i will be fetching the entire details of that particular post and i will display the that detail here on this page okay so let's first okay here above this h1 view post okay now okay here we need to take a div okay with a class row okay and then we need to create one more div with a class column large four okay and then here it okay so here inside this uh, four column i will display the image and here i will display the uh, content title description category okay 
so now let's save it let's take it and put it here okay now okay, now we need to write the code to get the detail uh, get the complete information of any post okay so for that let's come here to our dashboard and let's select this code copy and okay and put it here okay okay that's fine okay now here I have written a query a select star from posts okay I want to get the post the details of a post where ID field equals to dollar ID okay and okay so now save it and uh, it will return uh, uh, if I get any record inside the table uh, whose ID is one for for example then I will get the complete detail I will be iterating a while loop and I will be getting the details and I'll store the details inside these variables okay, so now let's try to print the print those details so okay, for that's dollar data okay dollar ID here it will be ID I'll just copy this okay then title description then category then featured image okay now well, uh, let's print that data okay print our dollar data save it okay now let's refresh okay and define variable connection okay so I have not included my config file which contains my database details Just copy db.php which is present inside config okay now let's save and refresh okay now it's displaying me the details of my second post okay so now if I go back and click on view link of the first post then it will return me the details of the first post okay so now i need to display uh, this information in proper layout okay so let's come here delete it inside here want to display an image we go featured image okay Be above this we need to display our title okay go title uh, okay I'll save it let's refresh okay now it's displaying title and uh, our image okay, now let's bring it to the center text align center okay next here we need to display the description echo dollar description okay now let's save it and refresh okay now it's displaying me the description okay now let's display the category as well 
ای چرف Save it. Okay, now let's refresh. Okay, it's displaying category as well. Okay, so we're displaying the image, uh, title, description, and category. Okay, so now we need to display a uh, few links like uh, a like link, dislike link, and comment link. Okay, so and we also need to display a comment form here just below this post so that whenever um, once the user read this post if that user likes the post then uh, he or she can uh, add a comment for that post okay uh, so we will do that in uh, in our later videos okay, so now i will uh, display links like uh, links such as like dislike and comment here okay, so for that let's go to our editor and here in after below this we need to create a div with a class of g8 okay okay here first let's create a row okay and inside this row create a div with a class of G8 okay and then another div with a class of two columns okay and here inside this okay, I will create a link like okay and count of likes okay and then we'll create one more div okay and this one is for dislike this one is comment okay yeah okay now let's refresh okay now it's displaying like dislike and comment uh, this one is three three okay it's displaying like dislike and comment uh, links okay so whenever user click on like then the count will get incremented and whenever the user click on dislike the dislike count will get incremented okay and uh, yeah that's all for this video guys uh, in this video we discuss how to display a particular post in full detail in some other page okay and uh, yeah i just need to remove this id okay i need to remove this echo okay so now what we have done is whenever user click on any of the view link i will be rewriting the user to view.php file where i'll be uh, where i'll be fetching the detail of this uh, complete post with the help of the id that i am passing through the get url okay so from this url i'm fetching the id of this particular post and i am fetching the details i am getting the details of this particular post from the database and i am displaying here on my view page okay so uh, that's all for this video guys i hope you like this video i hope you got some useful information out of this video if you like this video subscribe to our channel click on like button share it with your friends and i will see you guys in my next video where i'll be discussing on uh, updating or editing the already existing record okay uh, yeah, yeah, I will see you guys in my next video and thanks for watching.